All right, guys, welcome back to the channel. Welcome to my trailer. This is my 16-foot enclosed cargo trailer. I use this mainly as like my dirt bike, uh, kind of like motocross, ATV trailer. Uh, I've, I love the trailer. I've got a lot of E-Track in here, and I've partnered with OneCent. They're a, they're a company that makes a lot of great E-Track accessories, D-rings, tie-down, all kinds of things for trailers, garages, shops, things like that. So I want to show you some really cool E-Track accessories as well as some really heavy-duty tie-down points for, the, for this trailer. So like I said, this trailer is 16 feet long. It has E-Track on the walls, the floor. It also has it over here as well. I got some back behind my cabinets there. Uh, E-Track is great because it provides a lot of versatility. With a trailer like this where you're doing different things, for example, like I can put my dirt bikes here, but I can take those off and then haul cargo or different things. The E-Track really allows for a lot of versatility. So having some E-Track, a lot of E-Track accessories really makes the versatility of your trailer a lot better. So this first accessory I want to show you from one cent is this square tube. It's a it has an e-track holder welded onto it, and this would go on the wall of the of the e-track, and it's going to hold like tools, pipes, long things, all kinds of things. Let me show you on the wall how this would work. So these come in a pack of four, and you can, if you have four of them, you can really space these out all the way down the whole whole length of, the, of a trailer or a garage. These would work well in a garage too if you're holding, you know, tools long things, pipes, tubing, things like that. So we're gonna put them on here. I'm gonna show you how, uh, how versatile these are. So I have these tool holders stretched all the way across. There's four all kind of spaced out evenly along the side here. I'm gonna show you a couple tools and things you could use. Here's a couple examples of use. Let's say you're a painter and you have big long extension poles. Those can lay all the way down there. Or if you do, this is my swimming pool cleaner pull or if you're let's say you're into you're a plumber and you want to put pipes you know pvc pex copper pipe you could fit that all there and hang there or just even in your garage you can even hang this uh, e-track in your garage and that e-track gives you a lot of versatility you can hang things on the wall really easily keep them stored in there so this is a this is a cool tool holder that's going to hang up your tools on the wall And because they're an e-track, you can change the position wherever you wherever you want. Take them on, take them off, spread them out. So really nice functional accessory for your e-track. This next accessory comes in a two-pack. This is a magnetic wall holder. It's got a really nice brushed aluminum look to it with these welded-on e-track holders. They're perfectly spaced to fit right into the e-track slots. So you could just put these on the wall. This would be good for, let's say, your garage or shop when you're working on things you can get your tools and they'll just so there's really strong magnets this will hold up to 22 pounds of tools that are magnetically adhered to this so here we can put things like screwdrivers a hammer sticks there and some pliers more screwdrivers got our air gauge a nut driver so like I said, this would be good for your garage if you want to just keep your tools kind of handy. Some of the most commonly used tools, just keep them handy right here. And when you're done using them, just throw them back up there and you know exactly where they're at. Nice strong magnets and it's got a very durable finish to it. So even though these tools are scratching against it, it's not leaving any scratches against it, which is, which is nice. And they come off the E-Track very simply and easy. All right, check out these cool little storage bins from One Cent. They have uh, these nice little E-Track holders on the back. So you mount this on the wall, and then these just clip onto the back, and you got four of these. One cool thing is they have a little removable badge on the front, and you can write on what exactly is inside this bin, put it back on, slip it in, and you know exactly what's in your bin here to help keep things organized. These come in a pack of four. So these E-Track clips just clip on. Just clip onto the wall. This would be good for your garage, workshop. And these bins, they're just a lip on the back. They just slip right over the edge and they're secured down. All right, these are especially helpful, like if your good buddy across the street moves away and leaves you his screw and nail collection, you can just throw them all in here, organize them. So a great way to keep your fasteners organized, separated, and these can hold up to 40 pounds. As long as your E-Tracks anchored properly, these can hold up to 40 pounds in each one. So really sturdy as well. 
I also like the bin can come off without having to remove the e-track holder. So if you just need to take apart, a, you know, a bin of screws somewhere, you just take it off, use it, and then you set it right back. You don't have to worry about unclipping the e-track. Now we want to take a look at these D-rings. This is from, the name is XIE Crab. They're a 4,500 pound strength D-ring. This comes in a pack of 10, and these are a heavy duty D-ring. The, the cool thing I like about these is there's six holes for mounting and screwing in these down. One thing you can also do is you can weld those. So that's those six spots is going to give you a nice welding spot as well. So you can get six welds on this thing. It's going to be very uh, secure. So it comes with the rings and the plates, 10, 10 of each. And then it comes with 60 screws. So it does have screws that you can screw these down. Six screws per D-ring. In my trailer here in the corner of the factory, the manufacturer of this built these, these D-rings here in the corners. There's one there. There's also two in the rear, one on each side. So in each corner of the trailer are these D-rings. That's what most manufacturers will include. Now over here is my battery in storage bin area and I'm covering up a D-ring and so I need a D-ring. I'm getting my trailer ready to haul a, a full-size Razor, Polaris Razor side-by-side -side UTV, which, you know, those are almost 12 feet long and the front tires are going to be about, about to right here. And so I need a mount, I need a really secure mounting point up here in the front. I'm going to use that one and the two in the rear, but I want, I need one right there because I can't access the one behind the battery. So right there would be perfect. So I'm going to go down, I'm going to, where I'm going to put this here on the floor is I want to, uh, I'm going to pre-drill because this is going into the metal stud on the floor. So I'm going to pre-drill and then I'm going to screw these down and then we'll get this uh, D-ring secured on the floor. This D-ring is now screwed down to the floor. It's anchored into the metal cross member. It's very secure. I want to get my ATV in here and uh, strap it down, see how it holds up. So this is my Polaris Razor. It's the 170. It's kind of a small side-by-side, -side, but uh, it has some good weight to it, so it needs to be ratcheted down pretty tightly. So I'm going to get my ratchet out here, secure it onto the D-ring here, and then down to the A-arm right there. So let's get it ratcheted down. Ratchet right around the D-ring, and I'm going to just secure the other end right over here to the, and we'll start ratcheting this down. All right, this thing's all strapped down, and this thing is holding really tight. I mean, that's on there really tight. That D-ring hasn't moved at all. It's very secure. Those six screws in there is really going to hold it, make it uh, nice and tight, nice and secure. So I'm impressed with that. All right, guys, so these are some great accessories for e-track, for trailer. If you have a trailer uh, for your garage or workshop, these are some great accessories that are just going to make your trailer or workshop or garage just a little more functional, a little easier to use, the store tools to keep things uh, organized, definitely. I'm also impressed with these D-rings. I'm glad I have this D -ring, these D-rings in my trailer here. I'm going to get some good use out of these, especially having these six mounting holes. I'm impressed with that. These are super heavy duty, so excited to use these. Guys, uh, be sure to see the links down below. Big shout out to OneSet for partnering with the channel on this video and this collaboration. Uh, be sure to hit that thumbs up button, subscribe to the channel, and we'll see you in the next one. Thanks for watching.